Sultan of Riga, yeah, Barbary, star on the left hand side. Uh, so these are the most expensive plots, the most expensive streets in, in Latvia. Uh, there is a very big discrepancy between Riga and you know the second, third largest cities, I mean in incomes and in lifestyle and so on. To the left hand side you can see the government, the headquarters of the Latvian government, to the right hand side. The right -hand side. On the right there is the Russian Orthodox Church from the 19th century. As, as the city uh, was Russian after roughly 1710. And in front of us there is the uh, the statue which symbolizes uh, uh, Latvia and freedom and this woman Linda, it's, it's a very popular uh, female name in Latvia, uh, which, which embody uh, you know, some epistomize some, some, some characters from Latvian history. Uh, this street you know as well, uh, here on the left hand side you can see the, the university, Latvian university, with the flag, with the Ukrainian flag, and then there is a uh, forest restaurant, where we dined two days ago. On the left hand, on the right hand side there is the, uh, the opera house, and, and music plays uh, uh, an important role in, in Latvian national heritage. Uh, it, it's a similar story with, with Estonia, uh, the Latvians, they were traditionally peasants, you know, they were not noblemen on a regular basis the way it is in Estonia. There is, a, uh, there is this uh, uh, clock tower and, and there is this, the shopping center, and there is the uh, railway station in front of us and, and you know, this uh, uh, Baltica rail which is under construction. Uh, its population uh, has declined, is declining every year, you know, I check it every year whenever I come, uh, so now it's 600, uh, 625,000 people and uh, if this trend is to be continued then within a few years uh, Riga is going to lose its position as the largest city in the Baltic states. Okay, so central Turgis, uh, th there is the central Turgis on the right hand side, it is estimated to be uh, visited by uh, 50-60,000 uh, people daily. Site. and it is uh, because it's centrally located and, and uh, Riga and, and other Latvian ports they served uh, also uh, to Russians, I mean you know, Russian products were exported to, to Western Europe via Latvia. He meant he preferred uh, the Russians from Russia to the Russians from Latvia. He said that they were uh, somehow nicer and kinder and and and, and uh, you know this is this is uh, unlike in Estonia where the the Russian speaking population uh, looks up on, on Estonia and and uh, identify themselves with Estonia you know they uh, simply take pride in the fact that they live in such uh, well organized country uh, here there is attention and and uh, I think I, I I haven't met any Latvian no matter whether it was a Latvian speaking or Russian speaking, who claimed that everything was fine, you know, so it's somehow, you know, a bilingual society, uh, these proportions are uh, still in favor of, of the Latvians, like 60 to 40, but in, in, in Riga it's, it's the other way around, so the Russian speaking population is, uh, takes the upper hand. Uh, on the left hand side you can see the Palace of Culture, uh, built in the 50s by the Soviets, like the Seven Sisters of Moscow. And uh, they were unfortunately exterminated during the Second World War, so there used to be a ghetto in here. And, and people were sent to, to concentration camps and exterminated, and annihilated. There is, there is uh, the Daugava. On the right hand side you can see some skyscrapers and you can see this, um, you know, this uh, national library which was designed by an um, American architect of Latvian origin. And, and uh, look at this, this, uh, uh, this uh, uh, television tower, which is the highest in the Baltic states, and which is the third tallest uh, in the former Soviet Union, after Moscow and Kiev. It, it still symbolizes, epistomizes, you know, like elegance, uh, poshness, uh, you know, good taste, and so on. Um, but, but, uh, 
believe it or not, uh, there is uh, there is no access to the to the tower. So so no, they don't have any visitors. So simply, it's, it is impossible to get there either by car uh, nor by public transportation. And it uh, it is located on the island. It's uh, uh, 368 uh, meters tall, so times three, so it makes a bit more than 1,000 feet. Uh, by which it's one of the tallest constructions in, in Europe. And now you can see how mighty the river is. Then to the right hand side you can see the old town with uh, Peter's and Paul's Cathedral the, uh, located to the west. Uh, okay, so it's still the same river, the Daugava. Uh, on, on the day of our uh, arrival I met Elga who is uh, yeah, who is uh, a businesswoman and, and, and she runs a uh, travel agency who, uh, who is a subcontractor of Gate One. And what she said is uh, now you know regarding this political tension, she said that I asked her whether it was uh, true or whether it was fake that uh, uh, the Latvian uh, Prime Minister announced that those uh, Latvian citizens who are who support Russia, who supported Russia in the conflict, they can be deprived of their citizenship. And she said that. Uh, so again, I remember being in here crossing this border in 2007, and uh, still we at, at that time we were checked. So look at this. On the right hand side, there is the Latvian flag. You know this which is believed to be one of the oldest in the world, from 1280, you know, the whole story of this uh, fallen leader. Yeah, he has to switch from one country to another. And um, Lithuania literally means... Uh, in and, and the size of the country, similar Lithuania, is, is a bit bigger, but it's much uh, denser populated. As uh, you can remember, uh, Latvia was... Uh, 1.8 and Lithuania is 2.7. Okay, so look at this. So uh, to begin with, uh, take your uh, listening devices, uh, have them on you. And uh, but but at first you can freely use uh, toilets. Yeah, there are toilets in this main. I, I mean in the main building. And then once you are ready, then we can go on the hill of crosses. And also after it, you know, when, when souvenirs, then, then buy them after it, yeah. So the toilets are in this building where, uh, where it says I. As it says uh, WC, water closet.